Hello everyone, in this video we are just going to learn some of the AT commands that is related to SMS in GSM module SIM 900A. Let's get started. So here you can see this is the SIMCOM SIM 900A module which I am going to use in this course and this one is the USB to digital converter which we are going to use for testing the AT commands in this SIMCOM module. So regarding the connection between these two modules, we are just going to connect the ground of this SIMCOM module to the ground of this digital converter and TX of this module, SIMCOM module will be connected to the RX of this digital converter and the RX of the SIMCOM module will be connected to TX of this TTL converter. So let me just make these connections first. So here is the ground. You can see here is the ground of this TTL converter. I am just connecting it to the ground of this SIMCOM module. And regarding the TX and RX of this SIMCOM module, I am just going to connect it to Rx and Tx of this digital converter. You can see here clearly white wire is the Tx. I am just going to connect this white wire to the Rx of this module. So here is the Rx and Tx. See white wire is connected to you can see white wire is connected to Rx purple is connected to tx here purple is connected to rx and white wire is connected to tx and for now i'm just going to power up this simcom module with this adapter right over here you can see this is the adapter which i'm going to use which is a 9 volt approximately 1 amps adapter you can also use a 12 volt 1 amps adapter instead and using this power jack i'm just powering up and I am going to connect this USB to TTL converter to the PC USB port through USB cable that is mini USB cable. That's all about the circuit connections. Now I am just going to insert the SIM card in this GSM module. You can see I have inserted the SIM card. Now I am just resetting this GSM module with the help of this reset button. So the first and foremost command for SMS is AT plus CMGF. So let us check what is this AT plus CMGF. Select SMS message format. So when I give the value of 0 to this AT plus CMGF, PDU mode is selected and when I provide the value of 1, text mode is selected. So we want the text mode since we are going to type in the message in text we are just going to select the text mode. So I am just going to write the sequence for that command at plus cmgf is equal to 1 and finally as usual we are just going to give 0 to 0a and ok. Now when I provide this command to the json module you can see it has been set in text mode. The OK response has been provided from the JSON modem. And the next command that we want to use is AT plus CMGS for sending an SMS. Sending an SMS from the SIM 900A is a little tricky process. So listen carefully. So what I am going to do is I am just going to split this AT command into two parts. One is the AT plus CMGS is equal to the mobile number to which I just want to send the message. And finally, after the mobile number, I just going to give, I am just going to give 0D0A and that's it. So I am just going to keep this as the first step. And suddenly after executing this first step, 
I just want to execute the second sequence that is the message that I want to send in the SMS. So the message let's take it to be hello. Hello from SM. So let it be the message and after this message we just want to give a control plus Z. So the hexa value for control plus Z is nothing but 1A. So I am just adding 1A after this message and that's it. You can see I am just going to send hello from SM as the content of the message and following that I am just going to send control plus Z hexa value that is 1A. So what I am going to do is I am just going to send this AT plus CMJS is equal to mobile number followed by carriage return and suddenly after that I am just going to load this message content followed by control plus Z. So this is the format for sending a message in this SIM 900A module. So let me just test this. I am sending AT. I am getting the response OK. Now you can see when I suddenly send this I will be getting a greater than symbol and after receiving that greater than symbol I am just going to send this content of the message along with control plus Z at the end for sending the message. You can see I got greater than symbol now I will be sending this message content. You can see the message has been sent. You can see the message has been sent and here is the message you can see. I am opening the message which has been sent from the JSM modem hello from SM. So we have successfully sent a message from the JSM modem with the help of AT commands. Now let us try to read a particular message which has been sent from any mobile to the SIM card that is available in this JSM module. So with the help of same AT command, we are just going to perform the read operation of the message. So for that, we are having the command called AT plus CMGR. So let me just copy this AT plus CMGR for reading the SMS. So let's keep this position to be one right now. I'm just establishing the connection. Now what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to send a message from this mobile phone to the SIM card that is available right over here in this JSM modem. So I'm just replying to this message that has been sent from that modem. Hi. from phone. So I am just going to send this message hi from phone to this number that is available in this GSM mode. You can see the message has been sent and in my doclight terminal you can see the modem has responded with a certain response cmta colon of sm comma 4 that is it is indicating that in the message number 4 we have an unread message so for reading that unread message we are having the at command of at plus cmgr for reading the sms that is unread so here in the position of 1 i just want to provide the value 4 so now when I send this AT plus CMGR is equal to 4 of carriage return, what happens is the message that I have sent from that mobile will be read. 
you can see the center of the message is this one and that has been saved as sm academy and the message content is hi from phone which is the message that i have typed just right before your screen so we have successfully read the message from the inbox of the gsm modem and now we are just going to delete the same message so let's learn how we can delete the message so let me just open the data sheet the command for deleting is at plus cmgd so this is the command you can see at plus cmgda will delete all the messages in the inbox at plus cmgda is equal to you just want to type the type of the message that you want to delete if you want to delete the red message you just want to type in del of read if you want to delete unread just type in del of un read if you want to delete send unsent inbox or delete all you just want to send del of delete all so let me just delete all the messages at plus cm gda is equal to delete all at the end as usual we are just going to give 0 d 0 a so this is the command right so as per the command it is it looks fine at plus cm gda is equal to del space all let me just give this command you can see the response ok is given which means all the messages has been deleted let me just try to read this message in the question number 4 with the same command at plus cmgr is equal to 4 of carriage written you can see there is no response which means all the messages has been deleted so in this manner you can use this at plus cmgda for deleting all the messages are deleting a separate set of messages so i hope you learned the at commands required for handling the sms in gsm modem see you in the next video thank you